The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Manhattan, New York. Weighing in at 170 pounds, John Silva. Given the participants, this match might very well steal the show, guys. Yeah, and I think you could go so far as to say it has the makings of a match of the year candidate. And guys, there's no doubt he's becoming more aggressive inside the ring of late. Hey, as long as it's all within the rules, I like it. When it comes to the WWE, almost no good comes from being mild-mannered. Get ready to feel a shock to the system, boys. And his opponent, representing Undisputed Era from Saratoga Springs, New York, weighing in at 197 pounds, Bobby Fish. Bobby Fish incorporates so many styles into his offense from Muay Thai, kickboxing, catch grappling, and numerous other combat arts. Fish knows so many ways to hurt his opposition. Yeah, and a proud car-carrying member of the unpredictable group known as the Undisputed Era. You say unpredictable. I'm going to disagree with you, Byron. When the Undisputed Era is involved, my prediction is always on them. Bobby Fish is all business here tonight as he looks to dominate this part of his WWE career. The universally feared in-ring veteran Bobby Fish is set to display his combat art. And I can't help but get the feeling that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. Working for control. Wow. Oh, bridging package power bomb. In full control. Working for control. In full control. Lights out. DDT connects. Big time neck breaker. Head scissors applied. Oh, look at this. Training down elbows. Oh my god, what a forearm! Right to the jaw. What a hurricanrana. He's executing on his plan perfectly. Things are playing out exactly how he envisioned. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Ooh, what impact. Boom, what impact. Not where he wants to be right now. Stomping, ouch. Sit out, jawbreaker. You can pick up your teeth in the third row. Oh, right to the jaw. Oh, oh, you can pick up your teeth in section 112. Look at this. Boom, nice. Here we go, Byron. Oh, man, I got chills right now. Uh, 
just where he gets to the ropes, forcing the break. Well, Michael, I have to question the decision to go for a submission so close to the ropes. Plenty of fight left. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Oh, elbow to the knee. That'll hyperextend your leg. Lost in the corner right now. Wait a minute. Oh, my gosh. What a Frankensteiner. He's calling for it. Super kick. There's a pin now. Out. I think Bobby Fish's tenacity here is coming from his days training under Harley Race. This is a big risk. Will it pay off? He wants it one more time. Fifty. Here's his window. Will he take advantage? That might be the end of Fish tonight. Did you say he's filleted? He's got some fight left in him. He isn't going to go away that easy. Scissor applied. Oh man, vicious elbows. He has them right where he wants him. Super kick. Oh, stomping away. This could be huge. Oh, incredible athleticism. Sam Jawbreaker. You can pick up your teeth in the third row. Look at this. Snap suplex. Cover. Two. Two. I thought it was good night for Fish there. Here. 
Come on, man. Put your arms up. Play some defense. He's Here comes another one. 50. That's a match-winning move, guys. One more time throwing the heavy artillery. Two. Two. Oh, my God. He's done it. He's done it. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up. Here we go. that was ladies and gentlemen bobby fish did nothing but fall hook line and sinker tonight <laughs> with that win of the books we must now move on Worldwide. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Live Oak, Florida, weighing in at 270 pounds, Titus O'Neill. You know, Titus O'Neill is not only an incredible athlete, but he learns from his mistakes. Notice Titus walks to the ring these days. He learned his lesson at the Greatest Royal Rumble. Yeah, when he tripped and slid <laughs> head first <laughs> under the ring. <laughs> Great athlete, though, fired up here tonight on the grand stage. And his opponent 
from New Jersey, weighing in at 166 pounds, O.J. Cassidy. One-on-one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. And Byron, I'd say he appears to be at the top of his game right now. Well, he's going to need to be if he wants to survive this match. That's for sure. star tag partner even a manager Titus O'Neil truly is the real deal worldwide and if I'm not mistaken I believe we have some of Cleveland star athletes in attendance tonight oh huge big boot stomping down Titus with the power of the Gator his offense is second to none at times like this Just striking at will. Oh, man, what a boot. His shoulders are down. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Definitely has his work cut out for him. Lightning fast reflexes. Oh, my goodness. I didn't know he had it in him. What technical prowess from Titus O'Neil. He's a big guy. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. Take all the wind out of you. <laughs> Snap suplex. Very effective. <laughs> Titus O'Neil is feeding off this WWE universe. Titus O'Neil is powerful, fast, and mean, and those are his good qualities. The superstar known as the Real Deal is putting all of his energy into launching the Titus brand. Look at that power, Byron. Man, that is just careless intent. Right to the gut. Byron, you talked earlier about Titus O'Neil's desire of launching the Titus brand. This powerhouse has invested his life savings in launching the Titus brand and making sure everyone knows what it's all about. I'm a huge fan of the Titus brand. I'm of wearing, course you are. I'm wearing Titus brand designer jeans right now. And underwear. I'd like to go on the record and say that in 12 months, Titus brand will be a global brand for his and her designer fashion. Sacks that you're not allowed to wear. Bringing it back between the ropes. Very difficult position to be in right now. Oh. Can't prepare your face for that. Oh, man, incredible impact. Off the road. Move coming. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? Back to the torso here. Eliminate the. That should do it right there. One, two, real close. Too close for cover. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. If Titus O'Neil hits this one, this one's over. Ayo! Oh, a pendle! A pendle slam! Meet him at the pay window. You're going to want to see your internist after a slam like that. I'm on the shoulders! Down in a hurry! 
Titus O'Neil is tearing it up. It's starting to come together in a big way for this guy. Great offense by Titus O'Neil. Oh, knocked down with a shoulder tackling once again. His superstars climbing back into this match. Oh, Can oh, they oh, do oh, it? Oh, nice. His superstar still on the move, ready to strike from the top. Nailed it. Leg drop. He's going to the top rope. Flash. Will it be? Now that's a powerhouse kick out, King. That would have been a shocker. Oh, no. One of the first DDT. Uh-oh, submission move. do that i don't know michael but good thing i don't think he could have taken much more of that he's looking a little dazed guy he's looking for some sort of respite unable to get out of the ring he doesn't want to be hung up in the bottom rope like that right by. amazing kevin cue that up again oh man he may get the three count right here this is it This one's over. Take another look back at the action. And this match most certainly did not disappoint. <laughs> I think I might need to sell some of my Titus Worldwide stock after a loss like that. I don't think I saw one member of this Cleveland crowd leave their seat during that entire match. And I can't say that I'm all that surprised. He's got kids! So what? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Pineville, West Virginia, weighing in at 216 pounds, Heath Slater! I don't know, there's just something about Heath Slater. Every time I see him, I can't help but smile. Byron, I assure you, he feels the opposite way about you. The one man band got kids. He's ready for a fight. He's got no time for somebody of your type.
and his opponent from Niagara Falls, Canada, weighing in at 223 pounds, Sean Sears. Guys, this one promises to be absolutely amazing. But as they say, promises are made to be broken, Michael. Though in this case, I think we're safe. And let's not forget about his opposition who also comes into tonight looking to prove a point. Well, I should hope so, Cole. If you don't go into every single match looking to make a statement, then you're just wasting everybody's time. The superstars are ready, and so are we. Here we go. Sounds to me like this Saginaw crowd is fired up for this one. Here we go. Oh my God! Oh my God! Ah, snap there. Looks like Heath Slater is taking the upper hand. When Heath's going like this, there's just no one stopping it. Heath Slater showing us how to get it done. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. Right to the back. We got a cover. Plenty of fight left. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Oh, the body's not meant to be stretched that way. Is he done? Whoa, he, he works his way out. Set up for the oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Inside, cradle shoulders are down. Oh. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Too soon. Heath Slater put all of sports entertainment on notice when he was not a Raw or SmackDown draft selection in 2016. Audience have gotten behind Slater knowing that what he's done over the years is to support his family. Oh, and a knee. Hit another. A slight reason to worry here for Heath Slater. Taking on some offense, but he expected as much. Clothesline. Leg drop. Can he end it quickly? And Heath Slater barely kicks out of that one. Nice kick out. Double axe handle smash. Things have certainly changed for Heath Slater here in WWE once he became a free agent in 2016 for the first time in his career. The WWE Universe felt like Slater's unique brand of vocal enthusiasm and confidence was endearing. For most of his career, Heath Slater was not a favorite of the WWE Universe. That was until 2016 when he shared that he needed a job to support his family. I found that type of pandering to anyone who would listen to be pretty unprofessional. Man, what a clothesline! Heath Slater beginning to look a little tired. Yeah, he needs to make an adjustment here. And there's a reversal from Heath Slater. He's in full control now. Absolute dominance.
with the suplex. Heath Slater is fired up for this one. This is some great offense by Heath Slater. Heath Slater's making his kids proud. Training, strategizing, and execution. It's all coming together right now. Man, he planted it. The jump incomplete. Can he score the pin? One, two, three. What a win for Heath Slater. Now let's look back at that amazing action. So for Heath Slater, he grabs the victory here tonight. If you didn't believe this guy before, there's no reason not to now. Not after that performance. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest.